Hey there, it's Mark. I hope you have enjoyed checking out the Tomika diecast. They provided the card and sponsored the video. In the USA and Canada, Tomika are available at Walmart. Look for these brand new packages. They'll be hung on peg hooks. If you're a collector, you probably recognize these cardboard boxes, but now they're sold with these special window boxes. It's not a window box that you can keep if you take it out of the package. It's just for display. And this way, if you want to keep them in the package, not only, not only can you see them real nice from up front, but even in the back, you can see all the details. Painted tail lights. Check out that roof. You got decorations on the roof too. There's some details you won't even know about unless you open the package. In the back, you can see these models have opening hatches, opening doors. Not every model has an opening feature, but this one does. Here we have the Toyota CHR has an opening hatch. As far as I know, all of the Tomica models though, I should say Tomica cars, working suspension. Check out the bounce. Yep. <laughs> I love it. If you like to collect official licensed models, yeah, the Toyota CHR. Here you go. You can see the decorations in the front. Has a painted roof. Has the markers in the back. You have a logo in the middle. Right here, see, 164 scale. Not all of the cars are 164 scale, but they put the actual scale on the box and on the car. If you look at the base, look right here. It shows Toyota CHR, and up here on the right, scale 164. And I have found so far that they're all about in this region. Check out the wheels, by the way. They are plastic wheels, but you see this ridge? This ridge, this gives them uh, excellent rolling ability. They've been, Tomika has been in families for generations. They're from Japan originally. They're not just in Japan anymore. They're sold in lots of countries, and now they're back in the States. 164 scale on the Toyota with the Subaru Impreza. 163. On the back of the package, you'll see that they say that they, they make it to fit in the package. The scale is to fit in the package. And they're not always going to be 164 scale, like us collectors like to call them. This is another Tomika model that has an opening feature. Yep, first one I reviewed that has an opening hood. Nice and sturdy. Sounds really good. It doesn't feel like and sound like it's flimsy. Sounds fantastic. Painted headlights. Details on the grill. Let's see. On your pillars. You have decorations on the pillars. Check it out. In the windshield. There you have your rear view mirror in the windshield. And logo in the back. I got to check it out. It's really special to get suspension in die cast models again. All of the ones I've reviewed so far have had opening features or moving features and suspension, except for this one right here. Here you have the Isuzu Giga Fried Potato Car. It does not have suspension, but it does have moving features. You can remove this right here and you can just drive the cab if you want. Uh, so as far as I'm concerned, that's a moving feature. Let's see which ones had an opening rear hatch. The Suzuki Swift Sport. Had an opening hatch. Subaru, you gotta wait, you had opening doors. Here we just opened up the Toyota CHR. Opening rear hatch. Let's see who else is over there. Come here. You had the Toyota Prius, PHV, GR Sport, and hiding way over in the back, Mazda CX-5. That's why just looking at the package, you might not realize what kind of value you're getting. And here is the Subaru BRZ, opening doors, both sides. And so far the other one that had opening doors, sorry about that, Nissan GTR. And the only one with an opening hood so far is the Subaru Impreza. Now in the future, I don't know which models are going to have moving features or opening parts, but uh, suspension has just it's been a staple in Tomika diecast for decades. Thanks again to Tomika for sponsoring this video, and remember, Walmart in USA and Canada. Thank you for watching. Happy collecting. Bye-bye.